show didn't last very long, and the dogs are pulled in their own direction, gulping every piece of meat they could find. The suffering of the animal must be intolerable, but I guess the dogs don't really care. Finally, another sesame is brought down rather quickly and finds out what wild dogs are all about. No matter how much it resisted, there was nothing it could do. Number 7. Praying Mantis vs Hornets Thanks to queens that can grow to be 2 inches long and mandibles shaped like spike shark fins, Asian gigantic hornets, commonly known as murder hornets, can wipe out a honeybee colony in a matter of hours, decapitating the bees and flying away with the thoraxes to feed their offspring. For larger prey, the hornet's strong venom and stinger, long enough to puncture a beekeeper suit, combine to create an agonizing mix, with humans describing it as hot metal hammering into their flesh. This is all fine and dandy, but when it comes face to face with the praying mantis, as in this video, the only death this hornet will watch is its own. Look at how the mantis annihilates this normally formidable bug. This unfortunate hornet is undergoing a lobotomy, but it won't live to tell its friends about it. The second video shows what appears to be a hornet defeating a mantis, but it turns out to be another wrestling match with no clear winner. The fight between a hornet and a praying mantis is a little more evenly matched, and the hornet comes out on top giving the mantis a taste of its own medicine. Another mantis is seen devouring a hornet, despite the hornet's desperate attempts to sting the mantis. The hornet can only coil up in a ball and prey after the mantis decapitates it. Number 6. Snapping Turtle Snapping turtles spend most of their time underwater, waiting for their next meal to pass by. They're not aggressive animals, but they, like any other wild animal, will defend themselves if attacked. It's likely a turtle could bite someone's finger off, Alligator snappers, which may grow to reach over 30 pounds, can bite and leave a permanent scar on a person, but they are small compared to typical snapping turtles. The next video shows a snapping turtle barely holding on to this duck's foot, but the turtle is determined to make the kill, even though it's isn't as simple as it appears. The duck is urgently attempting to free itself from the turtle's grasp so it can depart from the water and flee for its life on land, but the turtle is holding on and I doubt the duck will survive. If it manages to free itself, it is much faster on land than the turtle. Number 5. Wild Dogs vs Kudu The kudu is a huge antelope that resembles a reindeer, and wild dogs enjoy eating it. The kudu in this video isn't so lucky, and it's being hunted through the woods by a band of dogs. The kudu is overwhelmed by the number of dogs it has to deal with, and things don't appear to be getting any better. The kudu is dragged to the ground against its will, and while it is still alive, the dogs feast on it. This lovely creature's time has come to an end. While a lone wild dog chases a solitary kudu into the water, hyenas call out in the distance, apparently knowing of the hunt and attempting to take the kill. The wild dog is kept at bay by the kudu staying in the water. These wild dogs chase this kudu through a swamp and eventually grab it. While the dogs are prepping their dinner, a nearby herd of elephants comes to see what is going on. The presence of the elephant scares the dogs, but it's too late for the kudu. Finally, while waiting for the rest of the pack to join her, a lone female wild dog demonstrates tremendous strength by taking down a juvenile kudu by itself and feasting on it. Number 4. Hammerhead Shark vs Stingray A stingray lurking from behind the ocean floor is discovered by a hammerhead shark. The stingray, unsettled, makes a break for freedom. But is it too late? The stingray has no other option but to bolt from cover so the shark chases it wherever it goes until it locks the prey and immobilizes it. And that's the end of the stingray. I'm not sure why aquarium administrators would put a stingray in the same aquarium as a hammerhead shark, unless it was an intentional to feed the shark, which is exactly what is happening. It looks like the stingray always gets the short end of the stick when it is confronted to the hammerhead shark, just like in this footage. Number 3. Dingo Hunting Dingoes are Australia's largest meat eaters, hunting a wide variety of animals. They primarily hunt at night. Dingoes may hunt alone or in packs, depending on the size of the prey. The dingo is a generalist predator that will scour the landscape for food and consume whatever it comes across. This pack of dingoes is on the hunt for some Asiatic water buffalo meat, and they target a smaller calf at first, but the hunt becomes complicated when the buffalo group together. The adults are very big, and it doesn't look like the dingoes are able to isolate one of the animals. In this video, a wallaroo stands its ground against a dingo. The dingo tries to intimidate the marsupial, but it doesn't work. This aerial footage shows a dingo chasing a mother feral pig and her piglets. The mother isn't looking back, and the piglet is much slower. 
So I'm guessing the dingo will eventually catch up to the little guy. And after going in circles for a few seconds, that's exactly what happens. What surprises me immensely is the mother abandoning her piglet to save her own life. I was sure she would have returned to at least defend her offspring, but I guess I was wrong. Dangos do not discriminate, and you can see in this footage, they will hunt porcupines, lizards, and even kangaroos. Whatever their stomach fancies, they will eat. Number 2. Stoat vs. Rabbit Although it will consume bird's eggs, the stoat is mostly a carnivore that feeds on small animals such as rabbits, hares, mice, voles, and shrews, as well as whatever else is available in its habitat. Birds are also eaten, and when other prey is scarce, earthworms, huge insects, and carrion are consumed. This stoat has made a kill, but now its problem is how to get that bunny through the fence. Watch how hard it works trying to accomplish this feat when with little more effort, it finally does. In this clip, another stoat destroys a much larger rabbit. It's as if the bunny has no means of defending itself against the stoat. Watch this stoat chase a rabbit many times its size, and as the rabbit becomes exhausted, the stoat attacks the back of the rabbit's neck with a strong bite. And it's the end of the road for the fluffy bunny. In this video, when a stoat is unable to catch a rabbit, it does dance motions. The stoat's prey is hypnotized by all the darting and writhing until the stoat can deliver the deadly strike. This little rabbit taunts a stoat, and it almost looks as if the rabbit is the instigator. But that doesn't last long when the stoat realizes the rabbit is the prey. Finally, a stoat chases a huge bunny rabbit. And I honestly don't understand how come the rabbit is so vulnerable when you consider the size of the animals involved. The stoat grabs onto the rabbit's neck, and eventually brings it down to finish it off. Number 1. Wild Dogs vs. Waterbuck a pack of wild dogs come across a mother and a calf waterbuck after seeing a large herd of impala that went missing. The small waterbuck escaped a large pot of hippos after being chased into the water by the dogs. The wild dogs eventually gave up after a few hours, and the mother and calf waterbuck were able to go unhurt. In this video, this waterbuck is being torn to pieces while it's still alive by this pack of wild dogs. I tell you, wild dogs are the animals that empathize the least with their victims. Next. A pack of wild dogs in Kruger National Park cornered and surrounded a young calf and her mother. The wild dogs were after the baby calf since it was an easy kill, but happily for the calf, the mother was tough and held her ground. Finally, these wild dogs finish off what seems to be another waterbuck. Unfortunately, it's not a pleasant sight to see, but it's the law of the land. I must admit, some of these hunts leave me somewhat perplexed. My favorite has to be the leopards arguing about the tree branch. Which one was your favorite? Why don't you let us know in the comments below? Well, that's it for our countdown of 15 wild animals hunting mercilessly. If you enjoyed this video, please give us a like and let us know in the comments what you think. Check out our other videos and subscribe to be part of the fun. Click on the notification icon so you can see our new videos as soon as they're uploaded. That's it for now.